everybody. Remember when I said I don't know what I'm going to make for my next video? Well, I know now. Woohoo. Oh, by the way, quick thing. I finally got foam paper. And I finally got markers. That's not important, though. I'm going to show you how to make a quick, easy, simple, very simple pencil. And um, for this, you can, you can do pretty much... You can do it however you want. I'm going to show you the best way. So, in this backpacker here I made today, yes, a backpack, you see. Oh. I have many things. For one, I have a composition book. You can look at my froggy stuff, how to make this. This is probably the most simplest thing. Um, I need a book. This is uh, just a book I made. And again, on this, you can um, do whatever you want for this. And with that, or cool stuff, pencils. Um, these pencils look a lot like real pencils, especially this one. Um, much like a realistic pencil. This is the second one I made. It's not as good, but it still looks like a pencil. Anyway, I'm going to show you how to make more. Okay. So, for this particular project, we're going to need toothpicks. Um, so, you see, I have these flat ones. For these, these aren't the best ones to use, but you can use them. Um... If you have regular toothpicks, you can use this. I already cut this one. For a little pet shop, you're just going to cut it completely in half. So one side will be flat, and the other side will be pointy. I'll put one aside. Um, okay, so after you cut it, what else you're going to need is colored duct tape, um, or design duct tape or whatever, or you can use stickers. For these, I use stickers because I don't have duct tape. And then you're going to need electrical tape or silver duct tape. I don't have that. So I'm going to use electrical tape. It's kind of just like mini black duct tape. Ever? Yeah. That's electrical tape. And then you might need scissors, but probably not. And finger clippers. That's what you're going to use to clip the, pe the, not the pencil, um, thing in half. Okay, so, and then what you're going to do, there's two ways you can do this. I'll show you my favorite way and then the boring way. I'll show you the boring way first, and then you can do this. Way. So you're going to take a yellow marker. And you're just going to paint, not paint, you can use, actually, yeah, you can use paint if you want to. This takes longer because you have to wait for it to dry. Paint the middle. Keep in mind, you have to wait. Did I say paint again? I meant color. I already said color, I don't know. You're going to color the middle. Um. Yeah, it's going to color it. The middle is yellow. You can color as much as you want. Usually people will do it just the middle normally. You probably can't see it because it's very bright. Whoopee. Hold on a bit. Okay. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take a Sharpie. Or a black marker. I'm just going to use Sharpie. And color the very tip. The sharp part. No. Okay. And then you'll have like a little pencil. But there's more. Then you're going to use a gray marker. And then color right where the brown flat part meets the yellow. 
and you're gonna just color that little section. Remember to leave a little, oh, sorry, little area at the end. Do you hear any noise? Again, my family. Saber, stop. Saber! Saber! Sorry, Saber is my dog. That's important, though. And then, you're going to take your pink. And you're going to color the end pink for your eraser. Remember to color the top, too. Okay, and then you have a little pencil. Just a normal little pencil. Now, best way, the way I like these ones. For this one, you're going to need the stickers or the duct tape. I have the same stickers as always. And, oh, and the electrical tape. Or duct tape. So, we're tape. So, uh, you're going to take your other half, other half, and then you're going to take a sticker of your choice, Just give me a second to choose, let's see, I think I'm going to choose this rainbow heart, yeah, it ripped, but that's okay, rainbow heart. Okay, so most of the time we're going to have to trim it if your sticker is too big. And mine is too big. Let's see. Cover this whole entire thing. So I'm just going to trim off the hearts because I really only want the rainbow. You still kind of see them, but mm, definitely not as much. And then you're just going to wrap it. Make sure it's not loose because the, the first pencil I made. And the stick of it being loose, it kind of looks weird. So make sure it's pretty tight. So it looks more like a view pencil. And ta da! I'll move that down. There, ta da! And then again, take your black marker, or in my case, the Sharpie. And color the end. Ta -da. This is the part. Now that's where the tape comes in. You're going to take some tape. Tape. And you're just going to trim off a little piece at the end. Ta -da. So let me redo that. So you're not going to want to make it too thin. Well, not like that big. And then you might need to overlap your sticker. I don't have. It's going to wrap it around the end. Remember when I told you the color, the gray? You're going to do the same thing, except we're going to do it with tape. And you're going to do the same thing. You're going to color it in pink. And then you got a pencil. Ta-da! Hope you like it. Like, subscribe. Um, so, thanks.